So, we meet again. That's right, automated kitchen module. Tonight, I'm cooking dinner for my family. Hmm. Now, where's your flipping on switch? Does this mean teaspoon or tablespoon? They need to find someone to try this. Anyone up there? Oh, no. Gordon? Hey, Virgil. How long have you been under here? From the second I sensed Grandma was looking for a test subject, I'm still recovering from the last family meal. Dad's desk. I guess, in a way, he's still looking out for us. Hey, you two, get out from under there and taste this. I get that everybody loves the TV-21, but it's just a plane. It's also a symbol of your father's determination. Ever since he was a boy, your father dreamed he'd be the fastest pilot who ever flew. So he and Brains built the TV-21. It was beautiful. A dream come true. Until the hood crashed it. But it didn't crash his dream. Your dad didn't care about being fastest anymore. He only cared about being first. First on the scene when people need help. First to act when someone's in trouble. And instead of one ship to do it all, he'd build five. TV-21 was the beginning of international rescue. gonna give we're not gonna make it hop in boys thanks grandma <laughs> I've never been more glad to see anyone's grandma in my life the protective hats in the trailer will filter the air everyone put them on <laughs> Hex! Virgil, you better get out of there now. Copy that. Step on it, Grandma! Compass is leading us right to a dead end. Well, on the surface, maybe. I'll bet whatever is causing the EMF is somewhere under here. Oh, without a laser bore or particle excavator, it's going to take a while to dig our way underground. <clears throat> Virgil? Or we could just use the underground. That's using your head. Voila! Thunderbirds are glow. How did you do that? I just changed go to glow and... No, not that. That. I thought the EKG was shutting off all the power. EMF. And it's shutting down all electrical power. The light sticks in my tool belt work on a chemical reaction. <laughs> like the one going on in my stomach. I think I brought one of my cookies. Oh, no, uh, that, that's okay. I'm not, you know, actually hungry. Well, you look at this place. It's like we've gone back in time, you know, to the Dark Ages, <laughs> right? They're right outside. Don't worry. If they manage to get inside here, they won't stand a chance. You know self-defense? I'll make them lunch. Mm -hmm. I admit it, I'm a terrible cook, but that confession stays between you and me. Got it? Come look at this. Could be a door. Help me get it open. What is that thing? <laughs> Who cares? Grab it! 
it's a glitch in the security lock. Someone was covering their tracks. And that someone is still here in the compound. Grandma went looking for brains. They could both be walking into a trap. I have to warn them. John, wait. Then you might get caught in it as well. Let me try something. There. I now have a subroutine nested in the transmitter room server. Is brains in the room? Yes. And so is the mechanic. The mechanic? Grandma. Brains better have a good excuse making me climb all the way up here. Any way to get a message to her? Stand by. This is about P Project Sentinel, isn't it? Hmm. You're trying to build a laser. A very big one, if I'm not mistaken. Not trying. I already have. And not everything here is what it seems. to stop. I, uh, do not approve of your actions. As a fellow engineer, it is my duty to help guide you down the right path. All right, then. Let's hear it. You need to l listen carefully. I don't want you only hearing every third word I say. Brains is sending me a message every third word. You must f follow all the lines, or a d disconnect is certain. Follow, lines, disconnect. What are you talking about? Reset. Your whole s system is failing. Thank you for your concern, Brains. It's touching. Huh? Reset system. I hope that did the trick.